Hey, what's up? How you doing? And welcome back to the 31 Days of Halloween. Today we are going to be reviewing our haul from Walmart. We looked through Walmart. We're going to show you some footage of what the aisles look like, at least at our store this year. Uh, as with the Target haul, we weren't too impressed. We did get some items that we liked and that kind of fit our style, but uh, didn't get away with too much this year from Walmart. Yeah. And everybody has different styles, so maybe there's more that you would want to buy. But with what our style is, this is what we bought. And we're just prefacing all of our new purchases before we show you guys our full indoor decor tour. Give you guys a chance to see what Walmart's got and what we got from Walmart. Kind of to accent what we already have going on from last year. Here we go. Okay, item number one. Ceramic pumpkin. It is a cookie jaw. <laughs> it is a cookie jaw pumpkin. Just plain on the inside. <laughs> Glaze still on the inside. Wow. We like this pumpkin because it kind of fit our aesthetic. We always have these little pumpkins lying around everywhere. And we like that it was a cookie jar so we could throw some candy in it. <laughs> yeah, I like this pumpkin because it's cool and we wanted something to decorate our tiny kitchen. And I just like it. And we wanted to put Halloween candy in it we've never had a cookie jar and whenever we have halloween candy out it's either sitting just by itself or in like a regular bowl so we thought it'd be fun and cute to have a jar specifically for the candy that we don't give to kids and we eat for ourselves and now we can hide it and not feel as guilty when family comes over <laughs> boom win for win as we said the pickings were scarce for us at walmart we didn't have good luck what we did find is these flickering light bulbs so last year, I don't think we had our, we have coach lights on the front of our house mm -hmm. in our driveway. When it's not Halloween, we have them on 24 seven, just kind of for security, I like it being illuminated. Uh, but I think last year we just had them off when we had our Halloween lights out there because mm -hmm. it was too bright, kind of ruined it. So we got the flickering light bulbs to try this year to still have some lights, but have it spooky looking. And also, sorry if you hear our puppy pacing in the background. He's a little restless right now for some reason. If you want to see these bad guys put into action, we're going to be putting out a Halloween outdoor decor video next week. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Item number three. <laughs> <laughs> this was, oh, we didn't say the pricing. This was $4.44. This has its price tag. <laughs> $4.44. Light bulbs were $1.52. Each. Uh, we don't know what the pumpkin costs. I don't remember. Probably oh, like ten dollars. Was it on there? Was it on no. here? No. Let's go with probably like ten dollars. I feel like it was we wouldn't like ten dollars. Paid more. <laughs> ten dollars, I'd say, is a fair accurate. <laughs> Anywho, we got this sign so that we could put it on the inside of our house. Doesn't really match the outside because we go more spooky, but we thought this would be kind of like a more. Cute addition. Light up gauze garland. Seven ninety seven. Seven ninety seven. What this is? It's like that spooky cloth that we have all over the place, but it has lights in it, and it's in a yeah. garland form. <laughs> um, I don't know where we're gonna put this. Yeah. I don't know. We're yet to figure that out, but we're gonna put it somewhere cool. <laughs> it's thirty five purple mini lights. Back. Black gauze fabric, no assembly required. Should I believe I we're going to be having them inside. That's yeah. how I would imagine. We'll probably have them on the inside, maybe around our TV stand. Mm -hmm. Maybe around, I don't know. You'll have to see our indoor decor we'll video. We'll figure that out. To see where they end up. <laughs> Ghost. Pumpkin. Jack-o'-lantern. Isn't it so cute? <laughs> we got these ones because we have hooks on basically all of our doors that we put little decorations on that we hang on the doors again you would have seen that last year if you tuned in and we just wanted to put another great addition onto our doors on the inside these are really cute they were this one was a dollar 98 is that one and this that one was also a dollar 98 <laughs> so it works great and then we can add to our doors to add more pizzazz inside the house more than just in the living room or the kitchen we can also extend it into our hallways yes 
So we'll have all sorts of stuff all over the house instead of just in certain locations. And there's a glittery side and a non-glittery side. This one's kind of lame. This one's kind of cool. Yes. In my opinion. <laughs> all right. And that's literally all we got from Walmart. Walmart had all sorts of inflatables and blow-ups and all sorts of little stuff, makeup, yeah. costumes. Some of it seemed a little overpriced. I was surprised, like, with the blow-ups. Because even at, like, Home Depot had some of the bigger blow-ups that were a little bit cheaper. We did end up getting a blow-up from Home Depot, so check that out in our Home Depot haul video. <laughs> But yeah, we just weren't as impressed. It wasn't yeah. really, like we said, our style with the blow-ups or with a lot of the indoor and outdoor decor type stuff. It was kind of cheesy, should I say? Yeah. Kind of cheesy. I don't know. It just looked cheap this year instead of like nicer Halloween stuff that was worth the expense. I'd say my favorite from this was definitely going to be the cookie jar. Yeah. I'm definitely. sure that we'll put good use to this. This is definitely something I'm happy with. And you can use it through fall and through Halloween and even when Halloween's over when you're going to Thanksgiving time. So it can last through a couple months, so it's well worth it. You can use it for candy, for real cookies, or for whatever you got to put in a pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, guys, thanks for tuning in and seeing what we added to our edition this year from Walmart. Be on the lookout for more videos coming up from us for different stores and Halloween activities. All right, and with that, we'll catch you in the next one. So stay spooky and tune in every day this month for a brand new video of various kinds, and we'll keep you entertained. See you then. <laughs>